so I will make this animation on this illustrator file you can download it from freepick.com or you can make it your own first I separated this layer I mean hand and microscope and also the background layer you can choose any shape layer as you want because this one hand will move above this and at this part the background layer will be zoomed in so first of all we have to choose this layer new and create an adjustment layer and what is an adjustment layer uh, it means if we apply any effect on this layer then that effect will also be applied on layers which are behind this one we have to create magnification effect we will go to effect distort and magnify and you can see at this point the center of this magnification is at this point so as we move the center the zoom point changes so we will have to adjust it according to the size of this or whatever you want a circle or rectangle it up to you you can choose it from if you want it to circular then circle and if you want it rectangular then you can choose square like this it will become square so in our case it will be a circle so to control the position of this center I will create an L object and make its anchor point to the center by holding control and double click and after that I will open the position and open this adjustment layer effects magnify I have to create this center to this position so whenever I move this null object the center of this magnification also changes so we have to create this we have to hold alt and click this stopwatch icon and after that click this and drag it to the position and now it's linked to the null object if we move this null object the magnification will move so we have to adjust it according to the center and change the size of the zone you can adjust it according to your requirements now what I have to do link this layer to the null object and also the hand layer to this null object now if I move this null object then both layers will be moved and zoom effect will be presented you can keyframe the position of this null object so it will move like one position at here and after that something like here it's up to you guys and it will move automatically and create a zoom effect thanks for being here i hope you enjoyed the video and please do like comment and subscribe to the channel thank you